welcome back to the Paige Core YouTube channel. I am Paige and if you're new here, a special welcome to you. So a few weeks ago, I posted a poll on my Instagram story asking persons which course do you wonder why persons chose. And the majority voted medicine. So today, I'll be asking 100 Jamaican medical students why they chose to study medicine. Let's get started. In order to message 100 Jamaican medical students, we would first need to find 100 Jamaican medical students. And how do I plan on doing this? Well, I'll go over to Yui Mona's Faculty of Medical Sciences Guild Committee Instagram page. I'll scroll through the persons that are following them and who they're following and send out some DMs. So while scrolling through while scrolling through the following list, we want we're looking for someone who looks like they're a medical student via their post, their profile picture, and if they have medical students or some logo in their bio. So I found someone, his name is Simon Scully. He is completing medical school in 2025. So I'm going to message him. So I'm gonna say, hey. I noticed that you are a medical student. why medicine and send and we're going to repeat that for an, for 99 more persons So here is someone, I'm not sure if they're a medical student, so I'm going to message them to ask if they are. Hey, are you a medical student? And send. And when the person responds, I will send the video message.
So guys, I received an action block from Instagram. So that means that I'm not able to send any more messages because my actions seem suspicious to Instagram. So I would have to continue another day. So guys, I finished sending out messages. Some on Instagram and some on WhatsApp. I didn't show me messaging persons on WhatsApp because I know these individuals personally and no introduction was needed and the conversations were a lot more casual so I contacted them off camera. With all that being said, we have 100 responses. Let's read a few. The first response is from Kira. Kira is a UA Mona MBBA student and she says, I felt like medicine chose me to be honest. I can't really picture myself doing anything else and I get this unexplainable feeling of joy whenever I think about helping someone. Kira is similar to Abigail who says, I chose medicine specifically in the field of dental surgery because I was always self-conscious about my smile. But I overcame those issues and I want to help others to smile confidently too. So similar to Abigail, I had my own insecurities about my smile. As far back as I can remember, I didn't like the alignment of my teeth. I didn't like the shape of my teeth to the point where I refused to show my teeth when smiling. But it wasn't until a sixth form where I moved past these insecurities and decided that I wanted to study dentistry to help other persons with their own insecurities. So I definitely can relate to what Abigail and Kira are saying. The next response is from Akim who says, I basically grew around the hospital and medical professionals and I like the sciences so it was always my first pick. Also, I don't want to be poor so here I am studying medicine. Guys, it's 2021, 2022 in a week. There are countless ways to earn good money these days. I don't want anyone to believe that you have to become a doctor to do so but if you're like Akeem that has a genuine passion for the field then I would advise you to study what you're passionate about and earn good money for your passion which is what Akeem is doing so kudos to him Jody says dentistry was never a first choice but I didn't know what area of study I wanted to do after high school I was young so a family friend who was a professor at NCU introduced me to the dental hygiene program there. I liked it and I have been a dental hygienist for the last 14 years. Although it wasn't my first love, I found joy in my profession. I felt limited in what I was able to do though and always wanted to be able to go the full circle as a dentist. I applied and had acceptance at dental school, but always thought I couldn't finance this because it was very costly, so I kept deferring. Kinda gave up on pursuing it, to be honest. Until my husband told me it was no or never, which I found crazy, because I have two children and going to school meant I couldn't work as much. He encouraged me, then I prayed, and UTEC sent me a letter to ask if I was still interested. And so I said yes and reapplied and started. When Jodie decided that she wanted to become a dentist, she already had kids, a husband, and a career for 14 years. But she wanted more. I started this YouTube channel to help tertiary students, especially those studying medicine. And traditionally, these persons are no older than mid-twenties. If you're watching this and you believe that you're not within the traditional age range of a tertiary student, know that it's never too late to make the impact you've always wanted to. After examining the responses to the question why medicine, I found that there were six main reasons given by students for studying medicine. The first is to help others. 59 of the 100 medical students stated that them studying medicine is to one day be able to help persons 
such as children, the elderly, or those with chronic illnesses. 38 revealed that them studying medicine is due to the love for the field or for the sciences. Some said they've always loved sciences, while others developed this love in high school at the CSEC or CAPE level. Six individuals decided to study medicine because of family. Some were directly encouraged by family. Some were pushed by family while others decided to study medicine after the loss of a family member. Four medical students credited a role model, such as a pediatrician or a family doctor for their decision. 23 individuals said that becoming a doctor was a lifelong dream or that they've always felt like medicine was their calling. And finally, four mentioned monetary gain for studying medicine. So those were the responses given by the 100 medical students. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for the continued support throughout 2021. Thank you for liking, sharing, subscribing throughout 2021. I hope that you continue to support me throughout 2022. Thank you. Bye.